Hi guys, how are you today? So I want to tell you a little story about the nutgrass and why I don't have any problem with it anymore. As probably most of you know, of you gardeners know, that uh, nutgrass is the most of the invasive weeds. Uh, and yeah, obviously I had it here <laughs> in my garden and at, the, at first I was really panicking and researching and looking for solutions. What can I do with to get rid of it? So after removing some of the nutgrass for the first time here from my mandala garden, I uh, brought it to the geese and to the ducks and found out that they really love it. Now I'm actually looking for the nutgrass for them because they love it. It's really nutritious for them. And what I basically do, I'm looking for the nutgrass now, getting it out. I pretty much get the larger ones only because I'm happy when the ducks and the, and the geese, they get chooks would probably eat it as well, I guess. You have just to be careful not to pull out your small seedlings if you have them in your garden bed. But basically, it really goes so quick And it doesn't necessarily multiply so quickly as I was thinking it would. So why should I worry about? Nothing growing in here yet. Oh, just some of the lettuce and some porcelain which we really love is very healthy and nutritious food for human and animals if you never tried it try it's really nice delicious juicy let's have a look in between the beetroots and i show you in in a minute we go to the geese and I show you how they love it. This another food source which doesn't cost any money to grow. You don't have to care about it. It grows in between your veggies. And your geese and ducks will love you for it. I didn't try with chickens yet. But we can do it at the end of the video. When we go over there. Okay. So this was about all together maybe about 10 to 15 minutes work not even 15 minutes at all so and i've caught like a three-fourth of this large bucket full of food for our birds and my mandala garden it's pretty much clean now there's still some little nut grass but i will leave it as i want to get it larger and bigger and have some food for, for the birds. This is how you can get rid of nutgrass if you have animals, if you have birds, and you don't have to use any chemicals. It will not um, disturb your, your veggies or your herbs. As you can see, they all grow very good, even though the nutgrass is coming. 
So yeah, let's go now to the birds and I will show you how they react. <laughs> So you can see they love it. Let's go to the mama. She got some little babies. Two only, but it's so... Look at them. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it makes fun to to collect it and give it to them. And they really need greens. And eat rather greens than than the grain. And the ducks. Hello guys, do you like like some of my nut grass? <laughs> so here we go. They love it. And again, especially if it's so dry and nut grass grow nut grass grows in your garden, be happy about it. Just look around, maybe your neighbor got ducks or geese or chickens. So you can make really a good source of food for the birds and give it to your neighbor. <laughs> Zola today as it multiplies like crazy in our little pond and the ducks love it as well have a look at it and I am giving them like half of a smaller bucket every second day so let's see if the turkeys like it yes they are eating it as well Yes, hello girls. Yes, the chickens are eating it too. They are all full because they had just breakfast. But still, they are eating it. Again, food source for your chickens. Look for the nutcrass, guys. <laughs> so the kids are finishing it off. All gone. And if you don't have any birds, any chickens, nothing, I would just simply leave it as a mulch. Just pull out the larger ones and leave them where they were growing. So it's a nice mulch which covers your soil and protects it as well and gives the nutrition back into the soil. I hope you liked the little nutcrust video. Uh, let me know what you think. Any comments or questions in the comment section below under the video and if you liked it if you like the idea, um, yeah, just put a thumb up for us, subscribe to our video, 
to our channel and share if you think someone else would have nut grass problem and like would like the solution so yeah thanks for watching and see you next time bye